Welcome back to the Noon Show on WBAY TV 2. Welcome to Ask the Expert and welcome back to one of our favorite guests here, Dr. Tyson of Tower Clock Eye Center is with us again. Dr. Uh, cataract surgery is for the most part pretty common, pretty safe, pretty successful around the board, right? Absolutely. So the patients come in, they know they have blurry vision, they have the surgery, they come out typically either immediately or within a day or two their vision is clear. It doesn't mean necessarily though that there's no need for follow-up and in some cases there are no complications. It can happen, right? Yeah, we like to follow patients going forward after surgery. Sometimes the uh, prescription, if glasses are necessary, need to be adjusted a little bit. Um, but then there are a few things that we look for also just medically and so we want to do a complete exam of the eye. What is a secondary cataract? Does that mean that it came back? Well, once we remove the human lens, it doesn't grow back. Uh, oftentimes, patients will talk to their neighbors uh, and discover um, that their vision has become blurry again and that they've had to go in and get a secondary procedure. So sometimes, as we're talking about surgery, they'll bring this up. And really what's happened, it's not so much that the, the cataract has grown back. When we do the operation, we place the artificial lens inside a clear membrane. And because that is living tissue and there are cells that line the equator of this capsule, those cells can change and they lose what we call contact inhibition. And they begin to grow and scaffold across the back of the artificial lens. So instead of looking through essentially clear saran wrap, they begin to look through what appears to be wax paper. And getting this taken care of it can be a fairly easy procedure with you, right? Right. It's pretty simple to explain to patients. Uh, it takes about 10 to 15 seconds to do the laser. And again, it's just sort of instantaneous um, clear vision. It is safe enough that follow-up appointments are not necessary. It is about a half hour from the time they enter the surgery center, dilate the eye to the time they leave. Uh, so people can drive themselves for this. Um, it's, a, it's a procedure that, that we don't necessarily worry about simply because of its ease and its effectiveness, but it is nice for patients to know that this is a possibility after surgery. If you have any questions, if you want to talk to Dr. Tyson or any of the folks at Tower Clock Eye Center, what is the best way to get a hold of you, doctor? Uh, certainly, just give us a call, 499-3102. Uh, you can go to our website as well. You can follow that information right on your screen as well. It's always available 24-7 by going to WBAY.com and clicking on Ask the Expert. Thanks for being here again today, Doctor. It's great to see you. Thank you. We'll get you back into the noon show here on WBAY-TV2 right after this.